Uh, Mitch McConnell apparently wants to put the brakes on the kind of progress that you're talking about. Uh, let's listen to what he said today about what would happen if the Republicans control the Senate next year and there's a vacancy on the Supreme Court. Are you suggesting that you are developing an argument for not holding hearings on a Supreme Court nominee if it's not an election year? I'm suggesting that I'm not going to answer your question. <laughs> what was your reaction to that? Well, Lawrence, I have two reactions to that. Uh, first, to quote uh, Cory Booker, I'm not going to let anyone ruin my joy today. Uh, it's a great day. I'm not going to let Mitch McConnell wreck it. The second thing I'll say is that I have to be careful because of the Hatch Act, can't engage in politics here, but it is not our plan to let Mitch McConnell make that decision in 2023. It's our plan to have Senator Schumer be in charge of making the decision in 2023. Uh, and I'm quite confident that if there's a Supreme Court vacancy, Majority Leader Schumer will make sure that person has a prompt and fair hearing. 